Hi guys, welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking. I have my oven on 350 and I'll bake this pie crust until it's nice and golden brown. So into the oven it goes. In my pot I'll put 3 fourths cup of white sugar. I have my burner on medium. To this I'll add a third cup of flour. I'll add in a fourth of a teaspoon of salt. Now I mix the sugar, the flour, and the salt. To this I'll add in two cups of milk. Stir it all together so it's all mixed well. Keep stirring this till it's thick and bubbly. Then I'll take it off the stove, let it sit for a couple seconds, and I have three egg yolks, and I'll pour a little of this mixture into the egg yolks, and then put it back on the burner. You can see it's turning nice and thick. Now that it's nice and thick, I'll take it off the burner and add a little bit of this mixture into the egg yolk. I have three egg yolks that I mixed into this bowl. So now I'll pour this warm mixture into the egg yolks. Keep mixing it. Now I'll place the egg yolk mixture back into the pot and mix until well combined. I slice two bananas and put them on the bottom of my pie crust. I let my mixture cool so now I'll place this on top of my bananas. So now I put the mixture on top, kind of straightened it all out. I'll place some more sliced bananas on top. So now I'll place this in my fridge to be nice and firm and nice and cold. Once that's done, probably give it about two hours, I'll slice a little piece put some cream on top and then it's ready to go and this is my homemade banana cream pie 